Good afternoon, Facebook. Good afternoon, YouTube. Good afternoon, Instagram. Good afternoon, Twitter. Uh, this is Adrian coming back at you. Uh, we're going to do a brand new series. Brand new series for you guys. Um, this is going to be exciting. Okay, so we already talked about in series number one uh, the biggest mistake that new homeowners make when investing in real estate. Okay, we, we took care of that. Uh, then we discussed uh, putting together your real estate dream team. All right, we discussed that. Uh, now, what we're going to do is protect our assets. That's what we're going to We're going to learn how to protect your assets. So we we know the mistakes that that you can make. Uh, you now have put together uh, your real estate dream team, and now you're going to go out. You're going to purchase your property. All right but you need to protect it all right so with that being said that's what we're going to do i'm going to give you guys a call to action uh subscribe to my youtube channel please uh engage share comment do all those things on facebook twitter and instagram all right so i'm asking you guys back me all right give me engage me tell me what i'm not giving you and we move on and i give you the information okay so what we're going to talk about tonight is asset protection all right, this is a big issue because a lot of people buy real estate and don't know how to protect it. All right, so rule number one in asset protection is that insurance is never a complete asset protection strategy. Say it one more time for you. Insurance is never a complete asset protection strategy. All right. So what you're not going to do, okay, I'm going to say this again. What you're not going to do is never let a commission salesperson tell you how to protect your assets. Well, Adrian, why do you say that? Because he has an incentive, and his incentive works on commission, all right? And number two, insurance agents are not licensed to give you legal advice. They're not. You understand what I'm telling you? All right? So, there's a whole section called bad faith litigation. And what I mean by that is that the bad faith occurs when the insurance companies say that they will cover you, okay? And you you bulletproof, nothing's, we got you, okay? We, we got you, don't even worry about it. Everything's covered, all right? And collect your money, okay? And God and heaven forbid that a claim arises and they find reasons not to cover you. That's bad faith litigation, all right? These people knew from the beginning that they didn't have you, that uh, insurance is not asset protection and they should never have told you that in the beginning. All right, so stop listening to them guys telling you our insurance is going to cover your assets. It is not a complete asset protection strategy. All right, I'll give you a story. Okay, a guy uh, owned a piece of property, piece of real estate. It was in a ski location where it's so uh, seasonal and, and so on and so forth. He went and he got his insurance and they told him, listen, uh, sir, don't worry about it. Everything's covered. This is bulletproof, don't worry about it, so on and forth, so far. And guess what happened? An avalanche. An avalanche came, destroyed his property, and guess what? They found out that they weren't covered for avalanches. All right? So this is the stuff that we're talking about. All right? Insurance agents are not licensed to give you real estate uh, uh, and legal advice, all right? That's not their job. They are not allowed to do that, all right? So I'm gonna give you a tip. Insurance is the first line of defense when protecting your assets, but the proper use of asset protection strategies is the second line of defense. Insurance is mandatory, is needed, but that is not complete asset protection strategy. The proper use of asset protection strategy is the second line of defense. All right? So I'm going to say this one more time. Rule number one, insurance 
is never a complete asset protecting strategy. That's your rule, all right? I'm out of here. I'll get back to you with part two on protecting your assets. I'm Adrian. I'll see you later.